As the world marks International Voice Day, we are here at South Sea in Nairobi to speak to a voice artist about the same. In the wake of the coronavirus outbreak in Kenya, executive order appointing health... I am a voice artist and also a producer, a radio producer. So I deal with uh, production of programs, production of commercial uh, items for radio, for television, and especially to do with voiceover. Voiceover artist, as we know them uh, within our communities, is uh, a person who uses their voice you know, for economic purposes, you know, making money out of it. Non-stop rumba. Muziki ya bakulutu. Kila jumapili kuanzia sa kuminambili jioni. Rumba is rumba. I started way back when, um, when I joined Radio Aumine. That was about 13 years ago. I was, I was on internship and there was a lot of opportunity to do voiceover, you know, for programs and for commercials, for station promotions. And that's where I started. Initially, I did not know that I could do it as a professional but when i began then i built myself and became much much better over time so in the last 13 years i have i have worked for several organizations within kenya and i've also voiced for uh, several external uh, commercial organizations milele fm inaibuka upia na kukupatia burdani la kishua I'm station voice for Milele FM. It keeps me, you know, at um, top of mind. Selexio ya papa Granton Samboja. Muzito wa Taita Taveta County. You have to keep doing practice. You get scripts. Read even a newspaper, you know. You don't need to have sophisticated equipment when you're starting off. You can even use your phone, record yourself, and then listen to other people. You know, professionals who are doing very well in that field. You have to take care of your voice, you know, for you to be able to do, to constantly use it. Then there are certain things that you have to look out for. You have to take care of your, of your personal health, you know, because it has to do a lot with uh, the way you eat, you know, how much water you drink. You should be able to drink a lot of water for you to... Uh, lubricate your 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 voice and you have to be careful about certain things that could harm your your voice as well you know like screaming for instance sometimes you can wake up and you don't have a voice and you have a script but you can't voice because your voice is not is not okay so um at that point then you could probably end up losing the job and it's given to somebody else it's not easy to get clients immediately when you want yeah you have to look for them you have to form networks and 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 always be in touch with the people who uh, send you jobs industries are, are not doing very well because of uh, covid 19 then it becomes harder for people like us to to get those jobs and even if you get the job chances are you're probably not going to be paid immediately it is a good job when you know what you're doing and you're focused on it and you're willing to look for those opportunities mm. you know opportunities exist online you can go online there's a voice one two three where you can register and uh, put your demos there people listen to them and send you an email and ask you to voice yeah there's a uh, voice crafters there's one called kovoko so there's the numerous opportunities opportunities are unlimited and i urge people who want to get into this to not just think about Kenya. The world is open. A microphone and a voice are the tools of trade for voiceover artists to eke a living. Dan Kaburu K24, Nairobi.